Good evening, everyone. What is up? Ate one satisfying meal, topped it off with a measly dessert. This is Mr. Hata speaking. Previously, there was one video on the college certificate programs. Today, this discussion will be on... What was that discussion? College classes that are not college level. There are at least several of these classes that exist. They exist at almost every college, whether community college or a four-year college. There's at least one of them from the hundreds of classes that are offered within one college. But this discussion will be on the basic or general ones, the ones that most students have to go through. And yet these classes are, are considered credit to the college students taking them. This is this is this is making one making one laugh. There are several classes that are not trans that are not transferable that they've created for, for for students for the sake of passing. Business math. They've allowed at least one or two majors to have students take business math and consider that their math requirement fulfilled. It is not, it will not transfer to four-year college, but that math is not college level math. <laughs> that is, that is not even algebra, algebra one. That's not even pre-algebra. That's a bunch of adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing. That is below basics for what they consider college, high school, even middle school. That's barely middle school math. It's a bunch of equate formulas and equations using the four orders of operations, and they consider that acceptable to community colleges. <laughs> and there's intermediate, the so-called intermediate algebra, which is algebra one with trigonometry. That is not. That's barely. That's ninth grade, tenth grade math. That is not intermediate. That is basic algebra. That's still beginner's algebra. Except it's not as much at the beginning level as algebra one from high school. <laughs> but they call that intermediate algebra. They think it's they think it's intermediate algebra, but in reality it's level one algebra. So algebra can be divided into three levels. Four, three or four levels. You have elementary algebra, which is algebra, a mix of pre-algebra and algebra one. Intermediate algebra, which is algebra one, trigonometry. College algebra, which is similar to algebra two. That would be 11th grade math. And pre-calculus, which is advanced algebra, probably 12th grade math. They've, they've, they've made up a bunch of silly math, and seriously, survey of mathematics. They have created one math class that's barely algebra one level two. All it is is basic algebra, basic geometry, word problems, and one other topic. Cannot remember it off one's tip of the tongue. <laughs> these, these math classes, they've, they've allowed students to take easy math classes. <laughs> That are not that are not advanced at all are not appropriate for college only because they want them to pass and not be stuck retaking the same class three times or more huh. but there are several others too can't think of all of them the foreign language classes are they're too easy in one semester, they should be covering much more than they are now. They should be covering everything from past tense, they should be covering present tense, they should be covering what they've learned in levels one and two in high school in one semester, since it is college after all. That defeats the purpose. They do not need elementary one, elementary two. It should be elementary put together and they learn levels one and two combined. Gym class. 
They have made gym class too easy to, too simple. They made gym class oversimplified. They have created, made the level, dumbed down the level of gym class to the point that anybody could pass if they show up and can, and can walk and have two, two legs and two arms, they can pass that class. As long as they can physically move, they can pass. All they have to do is know a bunch of common knowledge about the course, show up every day, do well in their physical tests, well enough to the professor's standard, and they pass. That's probably ninth grade level, heck, that's probably below middle school in several cases or more. What's another class? <laughs> Cannot think of that many more that are that general. That are definitely below the level they're supposed to be at. Anthropology. All it is is one, pa several papers in that one book. That is a bunch of Google images from Wikipedia and a bunch of information from Wikipedia. A bunch of simple information that even an eighth grader could could, could do on their own. <laughs> These classes. There are several other classes that cannot be named off, but it's mostly the math courses there that there are that many courses that are below the college level in math. Especially math. Not that many more that, that one can think of off one's head. Uh, maybe the English classes, English 101, Eng literature, all those classes are 11th and 12th grade. Most, there, most of the, a bunch of the classes in college are 11th and 12th, 10th, 11th and 12th grade courses. Referring to the beginners classes, they're all, they're all below college level. They're graded the same way high schools graded and they cover about the same materials as what high schools cover. Which makes one laugh because they're supposed to be college, yet it's c the continuation of high school years one and two. But that's all there is to say for this video. See you in the next video. Peace out. Good night.